in one of recent interviews, there was a scenario based question on uh, Terraform. The question is, EC2 instance is created using Terraform and uh, someone else in the team manually changed the instance type. If we do Terraform apply, what happens? That's the question. Let's go ahead and create EC2 instance from Terraform. Then let's go and make changes in AWS console and see what happens. Let's create resource that is AWS underscore instance. Let's name this web01. Let's define instance type. Let's give AMI ID. And uh, let's also add tags. Let's provision this resource. This is new project, let's init so that Terraform provider plugins are downloaded. It is successful, let's go ahead and run Terraform apply to create EC2 instance. It has created EC2 instance. Yeah, so this is the one. Let it come into running state. Now let's stop the instance because I want to change instance type. It is stopped. Go to actions, instance settings, change instance type. Let's make it T3 micro. Previously it was T2 micro. Now I am changing to T3 micro from AWS console. I am not doing this change using Terraform. That's important. Now in the code, we are using T2 micro, but in the AWS console, it is T3 micro that is manually updated. Now, if we run Terraform apply, what happens? That's the question. Let's run and see what happens. See, for Terraform, what you define in the code is final, meaning it is going to change instance type back to T2 micro. And if you see, it is modifying the resource. Something went wrong, just ignore and rerun the code. And go and check the changes in AWS console. It should be T2 micro. Yes, refresh. Yeah, it is putting it back to T2 micro. And also remember, it did not terminate the instance. It stopped and it changed the instance type. Thank you.